What's up? This is Fisanity from the Sis Bros channel. Today I'm playing Captain Tsubasa Dream Team Global version. And today I want to talk about um, League Mode, how to score a lot of uh, goals in League Mode and get a lot of Tsubasa points. Someone asked a few weeks ago, as you can see here uh, on my YouTube channel in, in the comments. So, and yeah, I want to make a video about that right now. So, uh, the benefit of getting more goals and getting more Tsubasa points is that you will earn more League Medals. And in, with the League Medals, you can exchange uh, these items. And the most uh, valuable item is the SSR transfer ticket. So, in this video, I will try to show you how you can get as much Tsubasa points as possible and score as many goals as you can in league mode. So what you're supposed to do is try to run through um, the manuals a few times. Try to find a weak team. Uh, okay, for example this one. My team is 302,000 and this one is 206,000. And we need to check out the opponent's team. Okay, he's got a weak goalie. He doesn't have a true SSR goalie. So we should play against this guy. And hope that we can score as many goals as we can. And then, in return, earn a lot of Tsubasa points. And eventually get promoted to the next uh, league level. Or stay in your current league level. And the higher you rank in your own league, the more Subas, uh, the more uh, league medals you will get at the end of the season. So it ends every week. So it will try, it will calculate how many uh, league medals you get weekly. So I will not do this auto in auto mode. I will do this manually so that I can try to score as many goals as I can. But usually I just do this automatically because I don't want to waste so much time. So, but for for those that have enough time, you, you should do this manually and try to score as many goals as you can. Pretty much you gotta score in every possession. All right, one nothing. Here we go. And also, you have to try to keep a clean sheet, of course. Alright, let's shoot again. Maybe I'm overkilling with uh, using my S fire shot. Maybe I should just use the B fire shot. Okay. Oh, come on. Alright, still went in. Oh yeah, and also try to get a hat trick. That will help uh, score more points, indeed. Okay. Let's try to clear the ball with the strong shot. Okay. 
Yeah, yeah. That was just meant for clearing the ball. Wasn't really trying to shoot the ball, of course. Let's try Diaz this time. So either him or Schneider needs to score in hat trick. Okay, critical. This will probably go in. Unless I hit the post again, or the ball explodes. Okay, 3 nothing. I wonder if I can score one more in first half. Probably not. Only, f yeah, only five minutes left. So you should try to score as many as possible. I've seen people score like over 10 goals. But you gotta play against a weak team like this one that doesn't have an SSR goalkeeper. Or you can play against a higher, higher power team, total power team than yours, but you gotta beat them with a high margin. That will give you a lot of Tsubasa points. Oops, he's using Sub fire shot. Alright, block it. Robson. Okay, cool. Locked it again. Argentinian combination shot. This shot is pretty cool. But it has to be done with Diaz and Pascal. Accept it. Oh, big mistake. Might not be able to get a hat trick. Well, actually, maybe I could. Time to get a hat trick. So it's good to have uh, at least two players that have an S shot on your team. Of course, the mo most ideal is having two forwards with S shot, like Huga and Schneider. I don't have Huga yet, so I'm using the Santana with maxed out B60 skill right now. But I haven't maxed out the notebooks yet. Still trying to max out the coach cards. So it's pretty weak at the moment, the, this Santana. The one from the raid event. Actually no, the one from the previous uh, event actually the one before the real japan 7 event 
Let's see if Schneider can score. Didn't press quick enough. It's important to quickly shoot the ball before you get a matchup. It's, but it's quite hard to do sometimes. You just gotta be really. You just gotta have really fast fingers. I'll stop any shot. And it goes in. All right. Five nothing. Can we do six nothing? Nope. Oh, I didn't notice that that was the last shot, actually. So you get you get the point. Pretty much, you gotta score a lot of goals. I didn't score enough. If I can do like 6 or 7 nothing, I could probably get at least like... 70,000 or 80,000 Tsubasa points. But you get the point, right? So you have to look at the breakdown. The more stuff you do... See? Giant killing. If you play against a higher total power team than you, then you will get this giant killing points. I didn't play against a higher level team, that's why I don't have any. But you gotta look at these stats. So the more stuff you do, the more points you get actually. I didn't do any corner kicks, didn't do any free kicks, didn't save any successful saves. I didn't, the, the guy didn't even have a shot on goal, so yeah, the more stuff you do, the more Subasa points you get. That's pretty much how you earn more Tsubasa points and rank higher in your league and get promoted. Uh, and this is the rewards you get in the in the in your own league. So if, if you can reach S League at the end of the season, you can get fifty thousand uh, league uh, medals. So I'm aiming for that right now. So hopefully I'll get promoted to A and then S in, within these two weeks. All right. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Please subscribe to the channel, comment down below, check out the Maverick Games deal for discounted dream balls in the description. Uh, share this video, subscribe of course, and if you feel generous, hit the donation link in the description and I'll see you guys very soon. Goodbye.